This is the graveyard fence. It's just a wood uh, primered and painted with the uh, latex uh, paint, painter's touch, Rust-Oleum painter's touch from Home Depot. It's the only place that had it. And the finials, as they call them, are pieces of styrene from the hobby shop they normally use for um, toy train or HO scale train uh, buildings and cars. And you, you slice it, or don't slice it all the way through because it's thick. I think it's 0 .030 thickness I used. Um, you use an X-Acto blade to score it and then you crack it apart. And even these little notches worked. This is half inch PVC from Lowe's. And it's about three feet tall. Um, the holes were drilled in the wood and it just fits in there like that up and down just so it goes in real easy um, and how it was connected they're connected with these shelving brackets from uh, Home Depot and they have a pin you can see the pin there there's the pin apart and you can see we drilled a hole and there's two pieces and the stakes are pounding into the ground about eight inches each and these lights are from Rite Aid I always like the orange color of them so they're just strung on there and a beware sign if after Halloween sale and then there's two um, pieces or sections you put sections on the other side of the sidewalk and that's in the middle of the sidewalk, four foot sidewalk Pretty scary. Oh, that's scary. you put up a border fence with black lawn tarp that I got at the Walmart lawn and garden section it comes in three foot by 120 feet and we powdered stakes into the ground and it just defines the space and keeps the fog contained and keeps kids from running across the yard and is easy to put up and it's stapled to these one by three stakes we took put two 15 foot pieces or sections on each side Are you buying gifts? Yeah, I can.